Welcome once again to Microbrands Unscripted. We have another unboxing, and this time, it's going to be a little different. Whoa. And already we're off to a bad start. My, my, my trusty uh, light shields. Very cheap light shields, I just f fell down. Okay, so, like I said, this is going to be a different unboxing because we're going to unbox a watch that we've already reviewed. There we are. Ubique watches. But this time around though, why are we unboxing it? Well, because we didn't unbox it like the first time. So you have the experience of getting these Ubique watches. Now look, they added this. And um, I think that's a sweet little something. That's, you know, a little... A little special and a little different compared to uh, the previous ones that we we got. We, we have this special um, timing is almost everything pamphlet there. And of course, what did it say there? Thank you for your support. Yes, Dryson Pua. That's the actual owner writing something there. And this is the actual box and we unboxed it. Not unboxed, but we reviewed their uh, watches before. We reviewed the box, but not as much as the other YouTube channels, but the experience is pretty cool too. It's like unboxing an Apple product because the box itself is pretty cool. You pull and it opens up like that. There you go, see? And we have, this is a pamphlet that they already had before, the dual series, very nice. Ooh. Sound effects. And the familiar travel roll that they come in they still come with these rubber uh, straps. Very, cool. Very nice as well. And this is your warranty card right here. Nice and very cool prismatic. I get, what is that number? That's not, that can't be seven. That's a reverse. Maybe number five. Something like that. You see, that's the serial number. But also, oh, of course, I remember the serial number is going to be at the back of the case pack back of the case back would that mean that it's in front anyway here we go and there we are oops and that is the beat red i chose the beat red this time and, uh, because i think that's the one that really popped into my mind and look at that so they had some improvements on this um model Let's put this out of the way first and then we can get a clear look at the beat red version of the duo. It's still going to be a 60 click uh, bezel. I prefer the 60 click bezel. I think it is it's 60 click. There you go. It is bi direction, bi direction bezel. And here you could see, yeah, number five. That is number five right there. Number five, case back. Let's take that out. Take that out. Number five, case back. I love the. I love how Dryson etched this case back. It's really nice, really modern looking, graphics design um, inspired. Or like, well, not inspired. The style. There you go graphics design style and the bracelet and so, so I'll take the plastic off of this bracelet uh -huh. now there have been a number of improvements compared to the prototype that I got last time but the bracelet is still very nice these, these are really long and wide links but uh, the finishing is splendid let's just say splendid just to mix it up you know my vocabulary is ever so expanding like a letter per day something like that you don't see me saying splendid all the time or you don't hear me you see vocabulary guys vocabulary there we go now let me show you this this is a an improvement to the previous version now we have a micro adjust 
And look at that. Look at the lettering there. That is also Dryson's design. Very nice. And it matches the whole Ubik uh, style, you know, of those rounded and yet somewhat angular designs. You can see the logo there, Ubik. This is one of the more popular micro brands this year, and so far it is still one of the more impactful because of the color, because of the uh, design. Those indexes remain the same. Some improvements here on the sides also. You can see the micro blasted sides are much better and much refined. It's not so sharp anymore, like a remember it. And also the crown. Look at that crown. There's also some curved notches on the crown. Very, very nice. Curved notches or knurling? Ner knurling? Maybe knurling. Curved knurlings on the crown. Very good. And you still see the, the index is there and how the lollipop hands still goes right inside the index. Very, very cool. I love that. And also how the, the date is still in the, um, integrated to the index design. So there's a number of improvements on this. And this is the actual production run of the Ubik Duel. And everybody's enjoying this right now. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about this new and improved Ubik Duel. Support this micro brand. It is a really good micro brand that we discovered very, very early in this, um, this year, 2024. And it's still one of the more successful and good looking micro brands this year. One of the best. So there you go, the Ubik production run of the Dual Series 1. Let's push, let's support this brand so that we can get the, the uh, what you call it? Not Dual, maybe it's a different uh, watch that they're going to be releasing next. But let's support it so that we can get more collections from this new uh, micro brand, Ubik, Ubik watches.